entrepreneurship is like the Olympics and we are in the middle of the Olympics now. Do you, I don't think there's a single Olympian out there who doesn't have a coach. So I would say some of my, my the advice that um, I got that was maybe most useful to me and, and I've, I've really taken it seriously with the company is to is coaching. You know, I do leadership coaching one-on-one. -on -one. I do leadership coaching in pairs with my chief of staff and with my with my co-founder, call it couples therapy. Um, and so, you know, the idea is that if you're in entrepreneurship, your job description changes every six months. So, you know, you need a coach to help you figure out which toolkit you need to sharpen or which help you stay present and, and also to help you pre-process the stress of the job so that you're not transmitting it inappropriately to other people on the team. And the other benefit that I get about implementing coaching with my team at large is that I also get a chance through this person who does, we are a small enough team that we, we work with the same um, proprietor for the same coach really for, for all of us is that um, I get information bubbled up to me, obviously not confidential information, but if she starts to see patterns with people on the team, she can flag those to me so that I can stay ahead of it. So I think coaching is a secret weapon for any CEO's toolkit.